Hello everyone, my name is Arios, and welcome to Through Oneself. This game actually sounded much more, that sound much deeper than the actual game might turn out to be, but it was made for the Ludum Dare game jam, um, the Ludum Dare 35 game jam, 36 is going on right now, and it was, it's made in Unity Engine, but it, it's apparently about a girl who is stuck in a different dimension, and you solve the puzzles by looking at the shape. The game jam was shape shifting, so that's what this is. So a lot of this is probably going to use like stock character models and stuff, but it's going to use its own gameplay to do it. And it's got a level select, so I'm assuming it's probably going to be like individual puzzle solving levels. So there are five levels. So let's see how well I can potentially not do. Level one. I'm blind. Mouse to move camera. Cool. Uh, WASD to move. Oh, 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 that's neat. That's that's neat. So I'm I'm trapped in another dimension and I can only see I can only see what's not interactable in this dimension, but I can see what's interactable normally. I think that's how the game was supposed to play, or things that don't exist or something. I don't I don't a hundred percent remember because I didn't want to spoil too much. Go! Oh, I see it. Yeah. Oh, geez, I got some hops. Okay. Use the mouse to scroll wheel. Zoom in and out. Oh! Oh, cool! Okay, so I do see these guys here. Oh, wait, that... Nope, that wasn't invisible. And... Huh, can I just jump this high? Oh, what? Oh, there's a platform here! Oh, that whole thing is a platform! Oh, that's neat! That's really neat! That's a cool concept into shape-shifting. Or in the, in the platforming... It and just the platform genre as a whole, because I have to use, oh, I have to use my character model to see where I'm going. Which it seems, it's kind of weird because it's, it's a very finite space. So you would, you would think, yeah, the closer you get, like you could see significantly more. Oh, cool, there it is. But you won't be able to see the actual, like, uh, environment in and of itself, or you won't see where the character's going. What is this, a paw print button? Uh Oh, so they're like portal button things, so that, that path showed me where it was going. Okay, so let me zoom in. Here it is. Oh, there it is, right there. And whoosh. Cool. This is cool. I I this like I like a lot of these concepts because like they, they have a lot of them, especially in like these game jams, because they only have a certain amount of time, a lot of them can be pretty unique in how they do it. Um, because instead of using your Whoa. Instead of just using your character's eyes like you normally would, you're using your character's model. Oh. Found a secret. Go celebrate. I did. Yay, I suppose. So it was a 72 hour oh wait. Crawl. Oh, wait. Right mouse cut. Oh cool. So it was made in 72 hours, so naturally it's not going it may or may not be considered a finished game. Um, I don't know how much... Oh, I can't just push it with my bunny. I don't know how much of the game the developers have... Oh, is the button up there? Nope, that's where the goal is. I don't know how much that the uh, the developers are going to push past... Uh, go any further with it, um, if they even will. Because, I mean, some of these game jam games don't go anywhere. And it's just like, up oh, quick game, let me develop this. And then boom, it's done. Uh, other games wind up going to be full games, which... I actually can't remember one off the top of my head because I'm an idiot. I know that there are some games, there was one game that I'm trying to, uh, I want to play, but it's, it's, it's not, it's still in development. Um, it was like, it's like Tower Fall or Tower Climb or something like that. And, but they have to wait for the game jam to end because they can't create and sell something that's in a contest. Uh, I think that's how the rules go or something like that. So there's a button. Psychic? I am? Oh, because it's it's not actually there. Psychic. I hate you, game. So this whole path is not actually here. That's okay. I'm getting. Oh, what? oh, there's a door there. I don't really know the point of the people in these maps because none of these maps look like cities. So it just seems kind of. I know they're supposed to. Be, she's supposed to be trapped. In another dimension. I know that's supposed to be the concept, but 
this other dimension it seems kind of non-building like I guess I, I don't really know how to describe it but mega hops hit so if this it, it's this might wind up being just a really short one because you know it's only 72 hours which hey I'm still more impressed by the people's ingenuity to make a lot of these in 72 hours and boop was there only five levels yep that was it in in plain sight created by Omni um, games programming graphics okay so it was it was a lot shorter or it was really really short um, which I expected. It, it was it was only a game jam game. Uh, there wasn't going to be too terribly much to it. So this is probably gonna this is just going to be like a, a shorter video. Um, I know the Ludum Dare 36 is going on, and I may uh, uh, I may I may pick up a couple of those and kind of do what I was doing before, where I pick three games and play them all in one long stretch. Because I, I I meant to keep up with that, but it's been crazy in life and reality and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I'm not gonna, I'm gonna stop complaining about that. But anyway, thank you guys so much for joining me on this adventure. If you have any suggestions on adventures you'd like to go on, leave a comment down below. Who knows, maybe we'll go on your adventure next time. See ya. Yeah, let me just mine some of this. Sweetness. So it's, it's, like I said, it's resource gathering, just like the forest was. And the difference is, I think it's more of a, 